Good morning, guys. Yes, yeah, so we're at Hermitage Farm this morning, giving you a little preview of what to expect at the Meet Your Maker Halloween Market. And there's nothing frightful about it other than the fact that you're probably going to spend some money to support these local artists because there's so much good stuff here. So we're checking in with local artist Amy. She's been working on this painting uh, since we started this morning. I mean, it looks like you're about done to me. Where are you at in this process? Um, pretty close. Pretty I got to work on the bar area a little bit more so the surface. This is definitely outside my comfort zone. I was going to say, if you take a look over here, these are what Amy is typically used to painting, some beautiful landscape and nature pieces, which will be on display um, at the market this weekend. But I'm going to come over here and show you something that I'm in love with. I've already planned out what I'm going to buy. Liz with Lion Palace. Can you talk to me a little bit about what you what you do? Clearly, lots of earrings. Yeah, I use a lot of uh, Czechoslovakian glass beads, a lot of Dalmatian jasper stone, uh, vintage 80s plastic beads are super fun crazy shapes and colors uh, get some African beads from a local shop discoveries that people might know about uh, all kinds of different materials shapes sizes colors all that and you're local to Oldham County why are you excited about participating in the market oh you know it's it's right down the street and I heard <laughs> about it and this place is absolutely gorgeous mm -hmm. and I'm so happy to be a part of it the, your stuff is so colorful what inspires you how do you figure out what to do next? oh gosh I've always exposed myself to as much art as I possibly can so it's just kind of been with me since I was a kid I was really inspired a lot by my aunt who was always doing crafty artsy things with me and uh, shout out to Aunt Lucy. Aww. I think I got a lot of this from her. So. <laughs> and it looks like you have some other things that you're gonna have here at the market this weekend. Yeah, I do hand painted uh, planters. Uh, we also do, I do uh, hand cut paper collage work. So I'll be offering a lot of those prints. Uh, so when you say hand cut paper collage, you cut pieces of paper out and yes. make this design. Uh-huh, that's right. Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I have a massive collection of vintage ephemera, weird little images. I use a lot of uh, different colored paper, all, all that. What does it mean to you for people to purchase your art or e your earrings and see them walking around? Oh, uh, it's, so, <laughs> it's so nice. It is like if it makes somebody happy and feel good about their day and what they're wearing and, yeah. you know, having a little flair, like that's fantastic. Well, yeah. this is happening on <laughs> Sunday here at Hermitage Farm. It's from 11 to 5. There's also going to be free trick-or-treat for the kids. There's going to be some hay ride options. There's going to be catering from Barn 8, which is delicious. Guys, I already know you're going to be like, oh, we're going to do some shopping, but I get first dibs <laughs> on the choices here. Okay? You know, we love clear. some earrings and accessories over here, oh, yeah. so we'll we fight over that. We shopping on, on the television. <laughs>